So good morning, good afternoon, and good evening if you're watching on replay, and welcome to Gone Shakula, the journey out of your head and into your body. A chance for you to rewire, reconnect, rejuvenate, regulate your body, mind, and spirit on a daily basis. And today we are focusing back down on the root chakra, on the mother, on Mother Earth, on Shakti energy, really grounding ourselves into Mother Earth today to feel her pulse, to feel her security, to feel her warmth and guidance as she nurtures us through our day. And they always like to try to do the mother on a Monday. Mm, it's a Monday, yes, it is a Monday. <laughs> you forget which day of the week it is. So if you have um, some essential oils, particularly patchouli or an earth, earth, earthly essential oil like sandalwood or cedarwood, all good, um, then just pop a little bit in your hands. If there's any problems, by the way, with the sound, then can you just give me a thumbs down in the, the um, emojis and then I can make up through the chat very well. So that would be absolutely amazing. Thank you very much. All right, you can take, um, rub your hands together and take a deep breath in if you have some oil. If you don't have some oil, then just take some breath anyway. And just place your hands together in prayer. Mudra. Mm. I like to have every class with some aromatherapy. It just helps us to get into our bodies. So many of us are disconnected from our bodies. And then when we have some aromatherapy, we just kind of drop out of the sympathetic, drop out of the stress and into the parasympathetic, into rest and digest. So let us begin our journey today. I'm coiling the kundalini energy, I'm coiling the snake, the coiled snake from around our hips. And I invite you to spend this journey with your eyes closed, mostly listening to your own body and just uncoiling yourself, listening and breathing the air always in through your nose and then you can choose to breathe down through your body or out through your mouth, wherever you need to release, okay? So in sitting poses, we like to move back down through the body. And if you've been quite active, you might want to breathe out, or maybe you just need the breath to release in that way. As I said, listening to your own body is really important. So join me for uncoiling, uncoiling the Shakti energy. So we're just breathing in one way and out, down through the other. You can go either way. Yeah, brilliant. All right, I know what's going on. All right, yes. Uh, okay. Sound is now on. Hopefully that's good. Give me a thumbs up if you can hear. Good, brilliant. Okay.
breath going down through the body. Keep going, keep going. 
coming down on your dog. Walking your feet out, stretching out your feet, and then walking your feet to your hand and rolling up. Bend your breath, hold your breath. And then just breathe it back out of your body. Okay. Now we come into the shake out. This is where we let go of everything that doesn't serve us. We shake out our body, we shake out so, shaking out our hands, shaking out our wrists, shaking out to the floor, just letting go. You can kind of twerk if you like, this is quite nice. Make sure you come up slowly, but just shake out as much as you can. Let your shoulders go. Ah, let your whole body just relax and let go of what doesn't serve you.
Hold your breath and inside out. Mm. All right, so now we're coming to the root, coming to Mother Earth, coming to that pulse, coming to grounding ourselves, feeling that we have good foundations to start our week and we really need it. If we're feeling a little bit rocky, we're feeling a little bit ooh, not sure where we're at, just grounding ourselves, padding through our feet, padding through our hands. So just feel in your yoni, feel the pulse of Mother Earth in your body. It just helps you just remember who you are, who you be, how you are connected to everyone else in the planet through Mother Earth. We are all connected. So feeling that pulse in your hands, feeling that pulse in your feet and just feeling the pulse around your body, high, low, fast, low, just drum and feel the beat, feel the pulse.
extend your breath, hold your breath, and then side out. Okay, moving now to the sacral chakra, moving to our water element, our flow, keeping our hips in flow, keeping us, yeah, bringing out the temptress, bringing out the creatrix, uh, allowing the temptress and the creatrix to work together in that beautiful divine union of sexual flow, sensual flow, creating as we go, creating through that energy, through that beautiful sensual energy in our hips. So keeping our hips open is really important for us to be in flow in our lives, our lower back. We hold so much in the lower chakras, especially in the sacral fear and guilt and shame in our lower chakras we need to release so we can move forward and back, side to side, moving our hips in a figure of eight. If you like, wherever you wish to go, you can jive, you can shimmy, you can belly dance, whatever you feel you need to release, okay? So let's just release from our hips. Day it over. Yes, seeing her this week. Cannot wait. Moving our hips.
suspend your breath, hold your breath, and let it out. Mm. Moving now to our solar plexus, moving now to our power and our strength and our courage. We moved, we've just moved into Leo, and this is where we have the courage, the courage of the lioness that her roar today. So this is where I invite you to uh, cut away, not only to step into your power and build confidence, but we do this by cutting away, limiting belief, boundaries, you can use the back of your hand, generational trauma, things that do not serve us, we need to cut away and step in fully to our power in this season especially. So join me, open your eyes if you wish, or if you're on camera, I'd love you to turn your cameras on, just for this one track, to dance, to play full out. Well done ladies, amazing. Let us dance together in unity, in connection, in love. <laughs> oh, she's got a torch, love it. Well done Kelly. Mm. Beautiful, let's do this. What surprise we have here today. <laughs> I love that. Shine your light.
with your breath and then sigh it out. Okay, beautiful. Thank you for joining me. That was really lovely. Remember it only records me, not you, so no problem. Moving now to the heart. Oh, opening up our hearts. Opening up our hearts is so important. So opening up our hearts, letting in the inner child, witnessing, noticing, acknowledging the inner child with all her fears, with all her fears of rejection and abandonment, humiliation, bereavement and justice. Let it all come forward without judgment. We tap into that inner child and we let it go. And we call in love, compassion, kindness, forgiveness, uh, non-judgment, and let it sit in our heart without tapping. And then we give ourselves a big hug when we're ready in the uh, maiden, you are enough, you are worthy, you are loved, never forget this. And because we have released the shame in our lower chakras, we can now fully touch our skin without shame, without fear, without anything. Just cross-bodying the left and the right of our bodies, our masculine and feminine bringing it in, calling it all in, up through our yoni, across our breath, giving ourselves a big hug, into the heart space, through the chakras, and around the energy body, feeling the energy around our body, our energetic body, and our aura, feeling that in your palms as well. So I invite you just to really begin tapping into that inner child, letting it all out, Moving into the maiden. <coughs> when you are ready, mm, so needed. <coughs> Excuse me, so needed today. Just yesterday morning, they let me know you were gone. Susan, the plans they made put an end to you. I walked out this morning and I wrote down this song. I just can't remember who to send it to. I've seen fire and I've seen rain. Just a 
to the throat chakra, moving now to our mantra, to opening up the blue lotus, to allow in the words, the song, the vibrations in the throat. So I invite you to come down onto your mat and take easy pose, whatever pose is good for you when you are seated. So sitting up nice and tall, sitting up nice and straight, as straight as you can, pulling in at your root block, your um, mulavanda and your uliyanavanda, pulling in your anal passage, your yoni, and then at your navel, sitting up nice and straight, opening your chest, keeping your heart open and relaxed, opening up the throat. So we're gonna sit in Gyan Mudra, so arms straight, fingers in the Jupiter and thumb, sitting up nice and straight. So allow the air in, allow the breath in. So you can just hum or you can sing or chant depending on the music or if you want to join in. Let's have a look what we have here today. Okay, so prayer to Kuan Yin, prayer to compassion. So join in if you can.
train up your energy channel on your way. <sighs> now moving to the third eye. So moving to our meditation, moving to the wise woman. You can make like a portal with your thumbs in your eyes if you wish. Just opening up your third eye, looking into the light, calling in your knowledge and wisdom outside of the monkey mind, outside of the to-do list today. What is calling you in? What is calling you in? Let the thoughts come in, let them pass. And just see when you look into the abyss, into nothing, what comes through for you. So opening up your third eye, Opening up your third eye, looking into your third eye. So you can look up into your third eye with your eyes closed or eyes open. Sitting in prayer pose, you may keeping those bottom locks, opening your heart. You can do a light Jalanda Banda in your throat, but keeping your eye focused. Hands in prayer mudra, thumbs into your thymus, into your immunity, sitting up nice and straight. Just feeling really open and looking into the light. And just spend a few minutes seeing what comes through for you in your, out of your subconscious or from your subconscious. What is coming through for you today? Or maybe it's something in the quantum field. Allowing it in. Making sure your heart is
So bring it back down to your shishana. Down into the channel. Okay, beautiful. Moving now to our <clears throat> savasana, to our crown. We're going to place that crown on our head. So we're going to just make the Venus mudra. So hands clasped. Push away the love. Push away everything, all the love we feel to everyone else in the planet. And then to make the Jupiter Mudra with the um, Jupiter fingers, your index fingers and all the others crossed. And then bring the Jupiter Mudra to your head. And we're just going to, if you're, if you're pregnant, please don't do this. We're just going to pump our Fire breathing, pumping our tummy just for one minute before we go down into a savasana. I am loved, I am worthy, I am 
am loved, I am enough, I am worthy, I am loved. I am enough, I am worthy, I am loved. Take a deep breath in. Sigh it out. And then to the throat chakra, I send you Reiki love healing and light. Repeat the mantra. I speak my truth to be heard today. I speak my truth to be heard today. I speak my truth to be heard today. Take a deep breath in and sigh it out. And to the third eye, I send you Reiki love, healing and light. Repeat the mantra. I listen to my intuition today. I listen to my intuition today. I listen to my intuition, intuition today. Take a deep breath in and sigh it out. And then moving to your crown, put it back on your head. Place your hands behind your head, feet together. Repeat the mantra. <sighs> I am the High Priestess and I call in full leadership today. I am the High Priestess and I call in my leadership today. I am the High Priestess and I call in leadership today, my full leadership today. Take a deep breath in and sigh it out. Bring your knees up to your chest and just rock from side to side. Grab hold of your toes, go into a high happy baby and just rock from side to side. And then we're just going to rock up together. Up when you're ready. Place your hands on your body, left hand on your heart, right hand on your heart. And take a deep breath in and then sigh it out. And again, when you're ready, take a deep breath in. One more time, take a deep breath in. Side out. Have a beautiful day, love and light. Thank you for joining me.